This topic I want to handle is a topic that is causing problem everywhere. And I don't like it. And I know that the Lord Almighty will help us, bless us in our marriages. In Jesus' name, amen. The topic is divorce. What is a divorce? I will start by asking questions. Do you know someone whose parents are divorced? Are your parents separated? Chances are that you can answer yes to one or maybe both of those questions. And you are not alone. About one out of every two or three marriages ends in divorce. A divorce happens after a husband and a wife decided not to live together anymore and that they no longer want to be married to each other. They agree to sign legal papers that make them each single again and allow them to marry marry other people if they want to. Divorce is hard for everyone. It might sound simple, but it is not easy for a husband and a wife to decide to end a marriage. Often, they spend a long time trying to solve problems before deciding to divorce, but sometimes they just can't fix the problems and decide that a divorce is the best solution. Change is a natural part of life, but when it happens to your family, it is sometimes really hard to deal with. Sometimes both parents want to divorce and sometimes one wants to and the other one doesn't usually both parents are disappointed that their marriage can't last even if one wants a divorce and to live apart more than the other sometimes it hurts kids feelings when one parent wants to leave the house where they live it is hard not to take it personally it's important to remember that divorce happens between the husband and wife even though it affects the whole family it doesn't mean that a parent who leaves the house doesn't care about kids many children Children don't want their parents to divorce. Some children have mixed feelings about it, especially if they know their parents weren't happy together. Some children may even feel relieved when parents divorce, especially if there has been a lot of fighting between parents during marriage. It is important to remember that divorce doesn't change one important fact. A dad or mom who lives somewhere else is still your dad or mom. That's forever. That will never change. Kids don't cause divorce. People, di- people divorce for lots of different reasons. Usually, parents divorce when they have too many problems and they just can't seem to fix them. No matter how hard they try, Sometimes anger builds up and parents fight. A lot of say mean things to each other. Sometimes they stop talking to each other because they are they are mad at each other. And sometimes they might sometimes they meet someone else that they fell in love with and want to live with. Adults have their own reasons for divorce. Whatever the reasons are, one thing is for sure. Children don't cause divorce. Still, many kids believe they are the reason their mom and dad got divorced. They think that if only they had behaved better, gotten better grades, or helped more around the house, the divorce wouldn't have happened. But this isn't true at all. Divorce is between moms and dads only. Even if you once had your parents argue about you, or your friend next door thinks his parents broke up because he got in trouble at school, these things don't cause a husband and wife to end their marriage. You might feel you are to blame for your parents divorce but you are not the cause and the fact that your parents decide not to stay married is not your fault children can't fix divorce yes just like the divorce is not a kid fault getting parents back together is not up to the kid either and most likely this doesn't happen although plenty of children wish for it and even try things they think might work acting like an angel at home all the time who can do that and doing really well at school may make you your mom and dad happy but it doesn't mean they will get back together the opposite is also true getting in trouble so your mom and dad will have to get together to talk about these problems it's not going to make the divorce go away either so just be yourself and try to talk through the feelings you have with a parent another member family or friend or teacher please what am i saying here divorce is very bad divorce is not good but let the lord judge everything Let Almighty God come to our aid and help us. In Jesus' name, amen.